shade cloth. What is this stuff? We keep seeing it everywhere. Folks, it's Chris with Simply Japanese Maples. I'm going to talk about shade cloth today. Shade cloth is a material that's pretty near and dear to our hearts uh, in our nursery here. And this is a material that's woven or knitted and uh, maybe other types too, I don't know. And uh, basically the stuff is, uh, it helps to reduce the light intensity on your plants. And so you can use it for your vegetables, you can use it for your living spaces, you can use it for covering up your Japanese maples. And so this stuff basically comes in different uh, ratings of shade. So typically you're gonna find 30%, 50, 70, 90, something like a 90 is going to make a very cool very cool down area for like a living spaces uh, living spaces for humans to hang outside whereas something more for your plants you're probably going to use like upwards of 50 so 30 40 or 50. Um, now the thing with your japanese maples is that the more you get closer to 40 and 50 percent your red maples will start to lose their red and become more green now, if you're only doing this for a few days, it's not going to be a problem, but if this is more of a seasonal thing where you're keeping um, that on there for many months at a time or many weeks at a time, you're definitely going to see some changes in those leaves. Not all of them, um, but some of them will definitely have more of a reversion to green. It's not permanent, but as long as it's under that shade, uh, you're definitely going to see that. Now, for us of the nursery, we're not worrying about that too much. Um, because it's really more about a water, a water conservation situation, helping to reduce that water loss from our trees in the hot sun. And so uh, shade cloth suits our purposes just fine. So you can see just above us here, the shade cloth, we have a 40% and this is our little shade house um, with some um, Japanese uh, Acer palmatum rootstock. So these guys don't mind this shade at all. Actually, they're really happy under here. You can also do things like if you had no shade cloth in your on morning light area and then perhaps you've got some trees that want protection in the afternoon sun, you could set up almost a wall or have some sort of um, structure built where then you have shade cloth for the afternoon. And in that situation, you could go even higher than your 50 or 60%. You could even have completely block out the sun and have them significantly higher, especially if it's, you know, ghost types or those types of trees that really want that afternoon protection. So, um, yeah, so there you go. So basically this stuff's super easy to find nowadays and I'm not gonna tell you where to find it. That's not really what I do, but I will say that it is easy to find and uh, definitely recommend it. Again, 30, 40, 50 percent. Uh, you're gonna feel more of a difference with 50 percent versus 30, um, but every little bit helps, especially in uh, the climate we're living in now where things are getting hotter and hotter more sustained, more sustained temperatures, more drought. So something to, to put a little uh, thought into. And uh, yeah, folks, if you have any questions, uh, comment in the comment section or send us an email. And as always, like, subscribe, helps our business get discovered. And as always, you can discover our trees at simplyjapanesemaples.ca. And until next time.